We tend to think of space flight as very exotic, but in point of fact, what goes on day to day in space is quite ordinary. You eat, you sleep, you go to the bathroom, you get dressed, you do your work. When it comes to eating, a lot of energy goes into deciding what the crew needs to eat, how many calories they need to maintain their fitness in orbit. And um, we typically don't have freezers and refrigerators in orbit because they are power hogs. So uh, the good people in the food sciences have come up with all manner of food, some 200 items. Standard favorite is macaroni and cheese, the ultimate comfort food. A crew member would go to the galley and squirt hot water into this and then really just massage it with the fingers and hands to get the water well distributed. This food item is the crew's favorite. This is shrimp cocktail, and crews report that their taste buds are dulled in orbit and foods taste bland. So the spicy cocktail sauce or other hot sauces are among their favorites. Anything to give it more flavor. Working on an experiment known as Biopack, which is from the On each mission, the shuttle's new breed of astronauts would conduct unique scientific experiments so you look in your checklist and it'll say at mission elapsed time, one day, six hours, 10 minutes, you turn on this experiment. So it's all choreographed to the second. The amount of science that we did on the shuttle was awesome. There's so many different fields that have benefited. Experiments were designed to explore the history of the universe, look down on our planet, and reveal the effects of zero gravity on life, from single-celled organisms to the human body. I wanted to understand what happened to people when they went into space. There's certain things that happen in your body because of gravity uh, that we didn't know before, because we've never been in a place where there wasn't gravity acting on us in some way. And the shuttle could do something that had never been possible before. Using its 50-foot-long robotic arm, astronauts could retrieve, repair, and upgrade satellites. What we did with the shuttle was really what you would call going to work in space. Putting satellites out, dropping them off, and sending them up to other orbits, retrieving satellites, repairing satellites, pretty blue-collar work, but we didn't care. I mean, we, none of us cared what, what we were doing as long as it put us in space. <laughs>